about to cut open. Baby Nuggie! If we don't get this video to 10,000 likes. Because for some reason, Baby Nuggie's diaper is stuck to his body. And I can't get it off. Uh, it's not working. So it is time to do this operation. In three, two, one. Ah, family, seriously! Family, today we're operating on all of the Poppy Playtime 3 characters. And chopping them open. But you have to be super duper careful whenever you use scissors. So unless you want my bro Edward scissor hand to come chop you up too. Smash like on today's video. Baby Nuggie's baby will be thanking you. And hopefully it will also be cleaning itself too. This family white diapers gotta smell like that. <laughs> I love eating burritos. Ah. Doctor, doctor, we need your help. There are some seriously sick part playtime toys that need us to save them. Oh no, oh no, not one of my favorite smiling critters. Family, look at this. All of these art projects are from a channel called Plastiverse, and they are the most talented Poppy Playtime doctors in the world. And they're trying to save Dog Day. What the chicken nugget? Dog Day, what just came out of your body? Is that a baby Bobby Bear hug? And a baby Crafty Corn too? Dog Day, I thought Catnap stole half your body and took it away. I didn't know you were hiding baby smiling critters in you. Like, come on, bro. That's not okay. But I guess we'll give you your legs back. If you promise not to do this again. This family, look at Dog Day. I think he's all fixed. Ready for Miss Delight to chase you down the hallway. With her pen. I'm just saying. Next up, we got Piggy Piggy. Oh, no, Piggy. What's wrong with you? Oh, you look super cute, Piggy Piggy. You have a full tummy. You're still pretty in pink. But wait a second. Why are we taking off your eyeballs? And cutting open the kitchen sink. Oh, wait. That's not a kitchen sink. That's Piggy Piggy's tummy. Okay, one apple. Bubba Bubba Fint. And even Crafty Corn, too. Piggy Piggy, why were you hiding all of those things in your tummy? It's like one big soup. Next up, we got Hoppy Hopscotch, and it's time for their surgery. Uh-oh, Hoppy, what happened to your knees? Because I think they're missing. Okay, wire in, spatula out, legs sewn back together. Oh, is it gonna work? Oh, oh, wait a second, what's going on with their eyeballs? Those are definitely not cucumbers they put at a spa. Now we're rubbing some suspicious liquid on Hoppy. And I don't think that's a face mask either. I think it's glued to stick their eyes shut. And after this day, Hoppy never saw again. All they did was hop. Huggy Wuggy, what kind of surgery are you gonna get? Whoa, hey Huggy, you look super happy for somebody who's about to be at the doctor's. Okay, wait, oh. Uh-oh, Huggy's arms and legs were broken. So we had to snap them back together to put them in place. <gasps> and now we're opening up Huggy Wuggy's tummy. And there's a lemon in that space. Huggy Wuggy, what are you doing eating full lemons in your mouth? Don't you think you're already sour enough? I suggest eating a chocolate bar instead. Because maybe then you'll be more sweet. And maybe your heart won't skip so many beats. Emily, do you think these surgeries were successful or not successful? Comment down below. But just like we did surgery on the real life Poppy Playtime characters, family, now it's time to do surgery on the magnet versions too. These are little magnet balls that stick together and make whatever character you want. So obviously, family, we had to do a little operation of our own and uh, make the most evil character from Poppy Playtime 3. Oh, uh, family, can you guess which character we're making? Okay, the color of the marbles are silver and green. But remember, they're magnets, so they're all sticking together. What do you think this is? Wait a second. Where did the green magnets go? Uh-oh. We got some eyeballs. We got some ears. We have a giant mouth. You know what it's shaped like? A Dorito. Because <laughs> it's super wide and a triangle. Family, now we're making the body. Oh, it's coming together and it's so big. Now we have the base and the arms and legs. And family, I think that's also a tail. If you know which Poppy Playtime 3 character we're making, comment down below. Oh, we just attached the tail. We just attached the head. Now all that's left to do is add the arms and legs. And the creepy claws too. One leg, two leg, three leg, four. Family, I know you know who this is. It's Nightmare Catnap. 
on the floor. But he won't be standing on the floor for too long before he starts to chase you. This family, I don't care if he's magnets or not. These monsters are hungry. Next population three magnet that we're making is the cute little smiling critters. Oh no, family. What's happening to them? They're all getting smushed. Yep, and that includes you, dog day. Catnap. <gasps> Nightmare catnap. No, 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 no. Oh, his head went pop like a balloon. But the smiling critters aren't the only people we're making out of magnets. Family, I have another secret character for you. Okay, this one may or may not be easier to guess. I'll give you a couple hints, though. It's a girl from Poppy Playtime 3. She has yellow or orangish hair and maybe an apple on her chest. Oh, oh, look. It's something red. I don't know if that's her hair or her clothing. <gasps> Ooh, I know what that is. That's her red skirt. That's her blue top. The red in the middle of the blue is the apple. <gasps> then we have her shoe and her other shoe. Family, this character is... Miss Delight! Oh, man. Miss Delight being made out of magnets is actually super duper cool. And family, the coolest thing about this is if you have these kind of magnets at home, you can make her yourself too. Just make sure you don't get the little pieces of magnets like stuck in the couch or stuck in your hair or, uh, you know, other places that you don't want them to be. And definitely do not eat them. They're not candy! Come on, bro. Whoa! Look at Miss Delight's head. It's so flippin' big. Okay, pop the head on the body and... Okay, okay, this is so cool. This is one of the coolest magnet art creations that we have ever made. Whoa, and we're even making her weapon too. Family, by the way, all of these magnet creations are made by this creator right here. He is super talented at making magnets. And if you want to see more magnet creations, go check him out. But as for Miss Delight, mm, yep, we have definitely cursed her mouth. Somehow it got bigger. Wait, why'd the screen get so dark? Ah, oh, hey, Miss Delight, I didn't see you there. Um, what's up, Miss Delight? <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't study. What's that, family? You know other people who also like cake, too? <gasps> and their name rhymes with Mylene Minners? Wait a sec, family. I think we're talking about the Smiling Gritters. Well, now I'm showing you the Smiling Gritters again. This time, they're all getting cursed. Because look at this, family. This used to be Bubba Bubba Finn. But now we took off his ears. We took off his arms. <gasps> and we're even replacing his eyeballs. <gasps> Wait, what is that? Is that the floss that I don't use to clean my teeth with? Uh-oh. Why is it going in Bubba Bubba Finn's eyes? Are those supposed to be worms? Oh, look, family. His eyes are changing. And he has corruption all over himself. Do you see all the silver magnets going all over him? He's turning evil. Oh, Bubba Bubba Finn, I'm sorry. I don't want this to happen to you. But honestly, now that you look a little more silver, you kind of remind me of a disco ball. So does that mean we're having a party? I'm not asking for me. I'm just um, asking for a friend. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 kicking chicken. Wait, 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 wait. It happened to you too? <gasps> Piggy, Piggy. Why is it happening to all of them? Oh, no. He looks stinky like a shoe. <gasps> okay, there's Hoppy Hopscotch, and they got silver all over them too. <gasps> Crafty Corn is taken over too. And even Bobby Bear Hug. Oh, Bobby, I'm sorry. <gasps> wait, Catnap, I already thought you were super duper evil enough. I didn't know you could get more evil. Oh, man, family. This is not, not good. Oh, lights are off again. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Um, hey, smiling critters. What's up, guys? Uh, how you doing? Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> we got eaten by Dog Day. And speaking of Dog Day, one of the smiling critters who used to be my favorite. You know, that is before he tried to make my arm into a meatloaf. Family, now I'm gonna show you how to make dog day into our dinner time. Well, um, wait, did I say dinner? I meant, um, plushie. We're gonna make him into a plushie. Cause I don't want to eat dog. And definitely not a cursed one. All right, family, look at this. We are making our very own DIY dog day plushie.
blush. And this is by a very talented creator here who is making this all by herself. We are starting off with Dog Day's head. Oh, and we got the styrofoam and cut it up into the same shape of Dog Day. And now we're carving out the top of his head. Wow, Billy. Look at all of these different colors of the material that's gonna be made for Dog Day's fur. We got the yellow. We got the brown. Oh, and we even cut it out into a very specific shape. And we're starting to sew. Go, go, go. You can do it, girl. I know this is gonna look so great at the end. Family, if you're excited to see our very own DIY Dog Day plush, smash like on today's video. So I heard if you smash like, then you might get your very own plushie yourself. Maybe as a gift. Maybe as a surprise. Maybe it will even be a chicken nuggy. Available at shoplikesy.com. Okay, okay, okay. We're almost done the dog day plush. Oh, family, I'm so excited. And don't forget, after we see this dog day plush, I have a secret video at the end of today's episode. Oh, ooh, now we're outlining the mouth. And we're even attaching the head. Okay, okay, okay. Dog day has a super big mouth. And he also has really big ears. Just like that. Oh, family, this is crazy. Okay, we're sewing Dog Day's ears onto this metal pole because Dog Day has such long ears that we want to make sure that the fabric doesn't end up scrunching up and folding. So by adding the metal pole, it will stay straight and secure. Okay, 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 we're adding in the fluff. Oh, we're even bending it too. Family, that is not a giant red tongue. Those are two of Dog Day's ears. And hopefully all of Dog Day's ears, because if he had more than two, then that'd be weird. Or a superpower. Because family, do you ever see somebody with more than two ears? I bet they hear everything. Oh, what was that we just added in Dog Day's mouth? And now we're making, I think these are his arms. Oh, wait a sec, wait a sec, that's his tummy. And we're even adding on a zipper onto the tummy so he can open and close like a real plushie. Oh, goes in the fluff. <gasps> Family, I'm so excited to see this final transformation. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, we're almost done, I can feel it. I can almost hear the woof, woof, woofs. Okay, come on, Dog Day, let's see what you got. Wait, uh, no, actually, Dog Day, can I see what you got? Cause I don't know what part we're making right now. <gasps> Oh, it's Dog Day's legs. Because family, remember, dogs have two hind legs and two front paws. Okay, okay, so those were the legs. Now we're adding on the arms. Oh my gosh, we're almost done. I'm so excited. <gasps> this looks like the perfect shape too. This kind of looks like a kicking chickens like rooster thing on top of his head. I don't really know what that part is. Oh, <laughs> that's Dog Day's tail. And then we got the sunshine as Dog Day's back. Attach on Dog Day's head and family. This plushie is complete. Let's see the final transformation. Whoa! Family, look how good Dog Day looks. Oh, the final transformation is crazy. Would you DIY this at your house? If you would, tell me in the comments. And now, family, since you made it to the very end of today's video, I have a special surprise for you. These are drawings of all of the very squarey and very scared smiling critters. And some of them have no legs. Hmm, starting off with Dog Day. Oh, family. But this isn't a regular version of Dog Day. This is the Friday Night Funkin' version of Dog Day. First, the original version of Dog Day. Well, Monster Dog Day, because the monster version of Dog Day has no legs. Ooh, which one is better? I'll let you decide. Next up, we have the Friday Night Funkin' version of <gasps> Miss Delight. Whoa, family. You tell me if you can tell the difference between the Friday Night Funkin' version of Miss Delight and the regular original version of Miss Delight. Okay, that's the Friday Night Funkin' version. And right now, we're drawing the original version. <gasps> I wonder which version's gonna be scarier. Ooh, or I wonder which version's gonna look more cool. Okay, um. Uh, I think maybe the original version is scarier than the other version, but uh, what do you think? Oh no, 
next up is Nightmare Huggy. You know, the version of Huggy Wuggy that jumped out of the screen. Okay, this is the Friday Night Funkin' version of Huggy because you can tell right below his boyfriend. And then here we have the original version of Nightmare Huggy, which is not any much better. Because everything that scares me is the exact same. What the chicken nuggy? Nightmare catnap, where did you come from? And boyfriend, why are you in his Dorito-shaped mouth? Did you confuse it for a Dorito chip? Because I promise you, boyfriend, that is not the kind of bowl of salsa that you want to be swimming in. And here's the original version of Nightmare Catnap. It's super spooky, but at least we are not eating a human. I guess that's an improvement. Uh-oh. Hey, Crafty Corn. What's up, bro? Oh, um, you recently lost both of your legs? I guess you're not doing that good. But let's see if the original version of Crafty Corn is doing any better than the Friday Night Funkin' version of Crafty Corn. Mm, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I think they're still evil. Bobby Bear Hug, let's see the Friday Night Funkin' version of you. Oh no, you also lost your legs too? And you don't look very happy either. But maybe the original version of you is happier than the Friday Night Funkin' version of you? Oh, yep, no, family, I was definitely totally wrong. The original version of Bobby Bear Hug looks even more sad. Oh no, Bubba Bubba Finn, you're happy, right? You're always smiling and always happy and always happy a chunk of your ear chopped off? Baba Baba Finn, what happened? Okay, what about the original version of Baba Baba Finn? Oh no, he has not one part of his ear chopped off, but two. And family, remember how I told you that Nightmare Catnap has a super big Dorito mouth? Well, apparently that trend caught on and went super duper viral because now not only does Nightmare Catnap have a Dorito mouth, but so does Dog Day too. <gasps> Wait a second, it's not just Catnap and Dog Day who have Dorito mouths, it's Miss Delight too? What the chicken nugget is going on, family? And why are all the popular Playtime 3 characters obsessed with potato chips? It's getting kind of weird. Okay, here we have the original Mr. Dorito-shaped mouse, and that is Nightmare Catnap. Hey, bro, nice to see you again. And then we have another newcomer into this new community, and it is Nightmare Huggy. Because his mouth got bigger, longer, and ready to start smelling like nacho cheese. <laughs> Family, if you like today's video, smash like and not subscribe. Go get baby nuggy, size nuggy, and demi nuggy plushie at shoplexer.com. Me and all the nuggies love you so much. And we'll see you all in tomorrow's video.